right, can you believe this? Scientists say that they've made an actual working shrinking machine. What? Researchers at MIT say they use a laser and gel, and with it, somehow they can reproduce a very simple object at 1,000, one one thousandth of the original size. Um, I don't know, is this like micro 3D printing? What's it good for? The researchers say the process could eventually be used to make teeny tiny computer chips or tiny robot particles that in the future, maybe they could attack cancer cells. I like that idea. But I still say it reminds me of Shrinky Dings. Did you not love those? We just made them. They have new ones. They still exist. They were so, they make little Christmas ornaments out of them. Love it. Okay, back to reality. <laughs> <laughs> Now, now I want to um, quote yeah. him. Uh, let's go to your retirement savings. <laughs> if any of the, uh, yeah. if any of it's in the stock market, you right. might be stressed. So, yeah. how should we look at this, Jen? Good morning. You know, and there's so many ways you might have money in stocks, and I just want you to know what's been going on because I think big yeah. picture, if you don't look a lot, you think, hey, wasn't it at records not that long ago? But you probably know from watching us in the morning, uh, it has been just ugly lately. Punch after punch after punch. Maybe we'll see a bounce back this morning, but last night, Dow Jones Industrial average look at that off 507 for the session